طلاب العربية طالبات العربية أهلا وسهلا بكم في درس جديد من دروس المنحة الدرس الرابع والعشرون الجملة الإسمية مبتدأ وخبر الجملة the sentence in Arabic فعلية verbal تبدأ بفعل that starts with a verb وإسمية تبدأ باسم It's a nominal sentence that starts with a noun. Now, الجملة الإسمية is of two types. الأصلية, the original, والمنسوخة, literally copied on the original. And those, المنسوخة is of two types, introduced by كان وأخواتها, كان and its sisters, وإن وأخواتها, إن and its sisters. This is, these two will be covered later in the process. المبتدأ والخبر Now let's take a look at the main type of nominal sentence that includes a subject and a predicate انظروا إلى هذه الأمثلة Look at these examples هي طالبة هذا درس طويل القاهرة مدينة تقع على ضفاف النيل الطلاب لا يحبون الدراسة في عطلة الأسبوع so notice the diversity of al-khabar and how it can be also a verbal sentence. Nonetheless, this is still a jumla ismiya fiha muqtada al-tullabu wa fiha khabar and al-khabar is a verbal sentence that on which the rules of the verbal sentence will actually apply. Yumkinu taqdeem al-khabar. You can actually front the predicate. The predicate can come before the subject in Arabic, but you have to have two conditions to do that. Shartani. A shartul awalu huwa al khabaru yakunu shibha jumlatin. So your predicate has to be a prepositional phrase. Remember shibha al jumla when we talked about al jumla, wa shibha al jumla wa majmu'at al alfa. And the second condition is المبتدأ نكيرة So your subject is indefinite Look at these examples في بيتنا غرف عديدة Literally you're saying In our house are several rooms فوق الطاولة كتاب Upon the table or on the table is a book لي ثلاث أخوات I have Two, uh, sorry, I have three sisters. So, li literally means to me, and it doesn't really say have as have is used in English. ملاحظة يمكن تقديم الخبر ولو كان المبتدأ معرفا للتوكيد. Sometimes you can actually have the predicate fronted and come in the front, even if the subject is definite for emphasis, and for that. We chose a saying in Arabic that goes فالتأني السلامة وفي العجلة الندامة There's peace and safety in deliberateness and slowness and regret in hastiness. شكرا جزيلا يا طلابي وأراكم بإذن الله في الدرس القادم.